and welcome back to the channel <clears throat> on this video I'm riding the Lyric Graffiti but there's a bike I want to talk about that's been out there for about a year and to be honest I was kind of keeping an eye on it at first to see uh, you know just how much it sells and and uh, and look for some videos on YouTube on it but uh, to be honest with you from the time it first came out which has been about a year now other than that when it first came out there was some promotional videos and stuff on it but nobody's really been riding it that I've seen and that's the bike put out by Indian motorcycles they partnered up with Super 73 basically it's a Super 73 bike with Indian slopping their name on the bike but anyway it's an Indian EFTR hooligan 1.2 so I mean it's a cool looking bike and all it, it just looks like the same style as any of the uh, Super 73 bikes basically but like I say it does have the name Indian on the battery but uh checking out some of the bike specs and uh let me get by this intersection here so checking out some of the bike specs the motor is a uh, 1200 watt peaks at 2000 watt but you know the one thing I could not find and maybe somebody can help me out I could not find the voltage so I don't know I'm assuming it's a 48 volt I could be wrong if you know what voltage this bike is maybe you could leave a uh, message in the comments and let me know but I'm going to assume it's a 48 volt it does have Tektro hydraulic brakes disc brakes The battery is a 960 watt hour, so assuming that's a 48 volt, that would be about 20 amp hours. And I believe the bike only comes in the one color, which is red, but it does look pretty good. I mean, I wouldn't worry too much over the color I mean it's that's fine uh, it does have the uh, Grizzly uh, tires that you see on Super 73's the Grizzly front tires 20 by 4.5 and the rear tires are 20 by 5 which is really nice I like the big tires they claim the bike to get 40 miles throttle only and that's riding it at 20 miles an hour pedal assist eco mode they say up to 75 miles on a charge it does come with a 3 amp charger the seat is really cool the seat is just a long seat the whole length of the bike basically the whole top of the bike is all the seat covers the whole area which is really nice so if you're a taller dude and you want to stretch out a bit uh, you can do that you can sit back a lot further
the one that gets me on this bike, I mean, it's nice and all, it looks nice. Uh, I did watch a video on it where one guy was saying that it doesn't have, the, I don't know what the torque number is because I couldn't, I didn't see that, but he said that it is not the fastest in the world on the takeoff. And I think that's true with all the Super 73s. I have not ridden a Super 73, but that's what others say that do ride them, is it does lack a little bit in the torque department. So let's talk about The price of the bike. So they're listing the price of this bike, and I've not seen it on sale ever, ever, ever. It's always the price, MSRP, a regular price, and that price is four thousand dollars. So I checked to see what the shipping cost would be. And the shipping would be an additional $99. So it's not free shipping. And so you're looking at a whopping $4,100 for the bike. So that's probably why the bike is not selling. Uh, a whole lot. I think it's more, it would be, to me, it's more of a collector bike for somebody who's got money to spare and they just want to get it because the fact that it's an Indian bike, the name Indian on it, I don't know. I mean, it definitely is a nice looking bike, as I say, but I think for your money at this you know, at this price of counting shipping $4,100, I think you would probably want to shop around and get you something or sell something a little bit better than that. But anyway, uh, I guess that's the same price basically as the Super 73s, right? The Mo I, I would compare it to the Mojave, I suppose. And the Mojave is running at $4,000. And I don't know what the shipping is. But uh, I know it's not free. Uh, it's not free shipping, I don't think. Super 73s, I think they do charge you to ship. If you do go and pick this bike up at the store, you can have it ordered to the store and you can get it for uh, saving your $99, but you still have to go and get it. And not many stores have it, most likely, and so uh, chances are in your area they probably don't even have it, so you, you wouldn't be able to go and pick it up. But anyway, I just thought I would talk a little bit about that bike because I don't hear a whole lot about it. And uh, maybe you know somebody or you have one yourself. Uh, maybe you'd like to leave a comment in the comments below on what you think of the bike. Uh, do you think you... Uh, are you satisfied with it for uh, the value, for the price you paid? So anyway, $4,100 basically for that bike. So anyway, uh, if you've got any comments on this uh, video, go ahead and 
leave it in the comments below. And I should give my personal opinion, even though I've not tried the bike, obviously, but I uh, think I would definitely, not think, I would definitely shop around. Geez, I think I would, honestly, I think I would just put $900 with that and get me a uh, Onyx RCR, you know, if I'm going to fork out $4,100 for that bike, I think I'd rather have the... Uh, the Onyx RCR that's running right now for $5,000 free shipping. This intersection here, oh, somebody's turning. Alright, well, that's gonna do it for this video. I just wanted to uh, talk a little bit about a bike that has been out there for a year and doesn't get talked about. I will leave a link in the description if you want to go and check it out for yourself. And if you'd like to, as I say, if you want to comment on this or any other video on the channel, you can go ahead and leave a comment below. If you would like, or if you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button. If you'd like to subscribe to the channel, thank you very much. Just hit that subscribe button and you're in, joining the team. And also if you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel, just hit that notification bell and you'll get the notification that a new video has dropped on the channel. And also we have a back catalog of more than 200 videos now on the channel. So if you want to check out some of my past videos going all the way back to 4th of July of last year is when uh, the channel started. Go ahead and check some of those out. So once again, thank you for joining me on this video. And until next time. Take care.